Good morning, I'm here with my lovely trusty bookcase and this week I'm gonna share seven of my favorite books. I was completely inspired by my dear childhood friend Rory who reads voraciously, Sandra who keeps reading uh, quality books and my mom who also reads nonstop. First book, gotta give it to the teachers, okay? Shout out to this guy, Michael Linson, saved my career completely. So his first book was Dream Class, and this book is special for the electives teachers, uh, just as powerful. His blog, super helpful. I mean, when I started to make the changes that he suggests in the book, I actually liked my job more, and um, that continued to grow and grow and transform my career. I was so much happier at work. So I often hear people complain about Gen Z and Alpha kids and all that, um, but, you know, they're just kids. They're just humans, so we get to do these same things, and if there's something that we want them to know that they don't know, we can share it with them, right? So this guy, he says, one of the things we can do is about praise. He says, we don't just want to say, you're amazing, that's confusing, okay? That's not to be confused with praise. But one of the, a better way to let students know they performed a common expectation well is to simply thank them for, the, for it, right? And uh, quiet, I knew you could do it, is a genuine heartfelt moment that can mean the world to students. So done right, praise can ignite burning intrinsic motivation. And that's really our goal, right, too ignite the students motivation to ignite their self praise and all those things so great book great author michael linson smartclassroommanagement.com check it out if you're a teacher